Hi, my name is Kate. In this video, I'm going to show you how to change or install the theme that you're using in WordPress. There are a couple of ways that you can do this. There are free themes that you can get through your WordPress dashboard, and you can also purchase or download themes from elsewhere and upload them. First, I'm going to show you how to find a theme through your dashboard and install it to your site. We're going to go to Appearance, and then Themes. You can see I've already got some of the default themes that come installed with WordPress. Now we're going to click Add New Theme here, or you can click the big plus button down here. This is going to take us to the Themes page, and these themes are all free through your WordPress dashboard. You can sort through the themes by themes that are featured, the most popular, themes that were added most recently, or you can filter through the themes. Let's click on Feature Filter, and this gives you a list of things that you can sort through. For example, let's say we want our site to have two columns, and we want the layout to be responsive. So let's select those two, and click Apply Filters. This will then load all of the themes that fulfill the criteria that we searched for. If you see one that you like, you can click Preview. This will show you what it will look like with your current site. If you like it, you can click the Install button. If you don't, you can just close to go back to what you were doing. Let's go ahead and install this one. All right, the theme isn't active yet, but we can do a live preview to see how it's really going to look and make some customizations. These are all of the things that you can change and customize with this theme. Most themes come with different things that you can customize. It really just depends on the theme. So let's go ahead and save and activate, which will apply this theme to your site. All right, real fast, let's go view our site with the new theme. All right, not bad. Of course, you would need to add in all of your own content since it looks like this theme has some default content, but that is how you would install that theme. Now last, I'll show you how to upload a theme that you've already downloaded. Let's go back into our dashboard, and once again, we're going to click on Appearance, and then Themes. We're also going to click Add New, and now, instead of looking through the themes below, we're going to click Upload Theme. Now you're going to locate the file on your computer that you've already downloaded. It should be in a zip format. I have a theme on my desktop that is in a zip format and ready to be uploaded. So I'm going to select it and then click Choose. Then click Install Now. All right, it's in the process of installing the theme. And once it's done, you can once again click Live Preview. All right, you can see that we have some different options with this theme than we did with the other one. You can change the theme colors, which is pretty fun. You can change the header image. And quite a few other different things that are available for you. Let's go ahead and save and activate this one. And now let's view our site. And there you go. That's how you would change or install a theme for your WordPress site. 